I'm Dr. Ben Johnson. I have three medical degrees, so some people call me doctor, doctor, doctor. <laughs> so I have an MD, a DO, and an NMD, naturopathic medical degree. And that's really uh, broadened my experience, needless to say, so that I can look at things from different perspectives and try to look at people as a whole. I've made a major shift in my life and in my medical purpose, if you would, from treating patients and trying to get one person at a time well to trying to keep hundreds of thousands of people well. It's so much easier to stay healthy than it is to get well. You can change that response. You can change it from fear and anxiety to a feeling of well-being. Thermography is simply phenomenal in, in many ways, again, because it shows physiology. It's the only test where you can see pain because as that nerve is damaged, it changes the blood flow and that's imageable on thermography. Do you have a headache right now? I do. You can see it. You can't see pain on ultrasound. You can't see pain on CT. You can't see pain on MRI, but you can see it on thermography. This little flare up above the forehead are common for headaches? It is not a substitute for these other tests. It's different. It gives you different information. You can see that there is a, a sinus congestive characteristic. The public doesn't know it by and large, but uh, inflammation and lymphatic congestion are primary causes of cancer. Chronic inflammation is a primary cause of cancer. And you can see that very well on thermography because inflammation produces heat. We're using the highest temperatures as being white, lowest temperatures as being black. And lymphatic congestion is a primary cause of cancer. And people don't understand lymphatics. The lymphatic system is the waste removal and the recycling center of the body. We don't have a little artery that goes to every cell in the body in the same way we don't have a little vein that goes away from every cell in the body. We leak. We leak by design. Out there at the end of the, the arterial system, we're kind of porous and serous fluid leaks out of the vascular system and bathes the cells in nutrients, oxygen, all of your amino acids and essential fatty acids, everything that that cell needs to live and be healthy. That cell takes those things in and then it excretes its waste products into the surrounding area. Well, there's no vein to carry that off. It's collected in the lymphatic system. So lymphatic drainage is critical to healthy tissue. Subsequent to the use of the SUSY, the uh, heat emissions overall have reduced a significant change in such a short period of time. With thermal imaging, if the Shuzi system changes lymphatic congestion, we can image that. And if that really does that, it that changes everything. This is Dr. Ben Johnson. I'm Dr. Melvin. With the Shuzi on, we see a considerable change in the congestive, this is the before, and you can see all of this congestive characteristics here, and then an immediate dissipation of the damming of the venous and lymph fluids. Uh, whatever this device has done is, is apparently made it easier to allow those fluids to return to the heart more readily. And that's a pretty dramatic change. And, and this is quite this, a shift. Yeah, this is something that normally, with with the work that we do, it takes uh, weeks to months to produce this type of response. And here we're seeing it in about 20 or 30 minutes. Again, without changing anything other than wearing the product called the Shoesy. Amazing. The Shoesy system absolutely is having a dramatic effect on the physiology of the body.